Hello everyone, my name is Patrick Cow, and I'm here to help you guys get access to your ebook and hopefully overcome any issues or complications you guys may come up with or run into during the process. Um, to start out here, um, make sure that you are using Firefox. Uh, this web browser is absolutely required in order to access the ebook through our platform. If you're not using Firefox, you may run into a number of issues which you're not probably going to be able to overcome. Um, so once you've gotten Firefox set up and you're in eLearn and logged in and you click into your class page here, to find the ebook link you will have to scroll down here um, underneath the learning outcomes and above week one right here, the, this link right here is your ebook link. Um, once you click this link here, it will bring you to this page. Now, if this is your first time accessing it, you're probably going to run into this little issue up here. Uh, Firefox prevented this site from opening up a pop-up window. Um, to fix this issue, or get around it, I should say, you will have to go click Options here, this little button over here on the right. Once you click options, you will want to go down to allow pop-ups for g4vhosting6.com. Um, this will allow pop-ups on our platform and our platform only. And once you have done that, go ahead and click refresh on your page up here. And if all goes as planned, you should be brought up into this new window here. This is CourseSmart, which is our um, online ebook platform. Um, whenever you click read now, you will be brought to one of two ebook readers. Uh, this ebook reader that you're viewing here is your classic view, which is the older version. Um, this version is honestly much more stable and going to act much smoother on your system than the newer e-reader, which you may run into some complications with. Um, let's let the new reader here open up real quick. Um, this is the new ebook reader here. Um, if you see this whenever you first get access to your ebook, You'll want to go up here and click Switch to Classic Mode. It's up here in your top right section here. Once you click that, it'll bring you back over to the Classic view, which will give you much better functionality. 